Hello, sunshines, and welcome to Devaliente Plays The Cave by Double Fine Productions. Assemble your team of three from seven unlikely adventurers, then descend into the mysterious depths to explore the cave. If you want to see more games like this from this channel, drop a like and a follow and tell me in the comments what you want to see me play next. Warning, this video contains strong language and imagery that some may find disturbing. Discretion is advised. Now, without further ado, Let's get started. Approaching the misty, snow-capped peaks the monk desires to call home. A sequestered haven of austerity and mental rigor, where entire lives are spent in the pursuit of becoming one with the world. Of course, our telekinetically inclined friend is not quite so ambitious. He'll be happy enough simply being the one in charge, no matter what it takes. Ah, fuck. <laughs> not at peace. To achieve enlightenment, you must pass the four trials of Zenness. Take this and begin your journey. Do not let your opinion of yourself grow too great. Remember this always. A single feather outweighs all mankind. Isaac Newton was down here once. I'm pretty sure he would call that scientifically inaccurate. That was quite a climb just to grab a feather and turn right back around. I think it's a Zen thing. You know, the journey to enlightenment is more arduous than any mountain path. That sort of crap. Mountain paths are still pretty arduous, though. Kind of funny how they fit an entire mountain inside of a old sign. What does this say? Nope, take that up. To, to a mind at peace, the lightest of things can be the heaviest. Okay. Okay. The door of enlightenment can be opened only by the one true master. How dare you? Okay. Enlightenment-seeking trio has completed the first trial of Zenness, which I'm fairly confident is not actually a word. I'm a bit behind the technological curve down here. You know, no spell check.
lotus blossoms. Oh. <clears throat> Impatient thoughts are as petals scattered to the winds, I see. Blossom pedestal, window. So I've got to find a way to close the window. Does it stay closed? I think I'm going too high. Do I need to bring the lotus all the way here? No! Okay. So maybe I put it down? No. Impatient thoughts are as petals scattered to the winds. Do I need to... <sighs> Am I moving too fast? Is that what's happening? Heavy ass feather. So as soon as I get to this freaking sign, impatient thoughts are as petals scattered to the winds. 
Okay, and I can't take it down with me. I was on the right track. No. Stop it. Net sack. <laughs> oh, I'm moving too fast. Okay. Nope, fuck. The monk has completed the second trial of Zenness. He seems to be tackling these challenges in good faith <laughs> and the proper spirit of calm. Of course, still waters run deep and very, very dark. <laughs> uh, by ordered, an ordered mind seeks equilibrium in all things. A sloppy mind just uses the internet. Monkpuzzle.com. <laughs> Six gallons of water. Scale pedestal. Okay. Uh... Four gallons of water. An empty four gallon jug. Okay. Seven gallons of water. Empty seven gallon jug. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay, so that was wrong. <clears throat> Wait. That's for A. That's right. Let it be known that the cave does not approve of using external sources <laughs> to circumvent official tests of skill and uh, So I'll just give them the benefit of the doubt on this one. In any case, that's trial number three complete, technically. I mean, I actually did it. I'm proud of myself that I didn't look it up. But thank you for muckpuzzle.com. Rising and ga. Oh shit. The path to enlightenment is a journey of peace and stillness of mind. Okay. I see. A journey of peace and a stillness of mind. Object of desire. And they're leaving me behind, I see. That roll dead. Okay. So you're going here. You go here. Nope. Go back. the hot dog. You are gonna go here. You are gonna go here. And you go here.
going to start us out at the beginning. Guess we just have to go die again. the carpets all the way to the top to spawn a rope and continue. I don't. You're wrong. Deepest desires okay. can seem so real, so crucial, can't they? But in the end, just like everything else, their glimmer fades. Surely the most worthwhile goal is acceptance of one's place in the universe. <clears throat> Excuse me, I, I think these Zen guys are rubbing off on me. Well, that's all four trials. Enjoy the fruits of enlightenment. <laughs> Only in meditation does one gain the fullest view of the world. Monkey, meditation statue. much as your own unguarded thoughts. Mm -hmm. Okay. All worldly pursuits. 
pursuits have but one inevitable end. Destruction. Really? Oh, look, a block. Like, I'm not gonna lie and say that I didn't look ahead on the guide, <laughs> but I did. Okay, wrong one. Just dragon attacks. Alright, now what do we do? I want to see maps of these guys. I'm dead. I see you understand what it is to be at peace with yourself. But be warned, a true Zen master is also at peace with the world. Oh. This is going to hurt. <laughs> hey, Grand Theft Karma. I don't think that's the orthodox method for obtaining this particular position in the temple. But what do I know? I never passed comparative religion. Do you suppose the monk's companions knew what he was up to? Do you suppose he himself knew? Or was he acting out the only path he had? I have my own thoughts on the matter, and I've had more than a few millennia to weigh it over. But I'll let you reach your own conclusions. Our friend the monk's tale is nearly at an end. Open for me. The door and I can only be one true master. Well. Do to do, do. I am master. <laughs> uh, oh wait. We're gonna take a break there. Thank you for joining me as I played The Cave by Double Fine Productions. The next episode will be out shortly. If you enjoyed what you saw, please leave a like, a follow, and ring that notification bell so you know when a new episode drops. Also, don't forget to check out the link to the completely free Discord server to chat about games and whatever else is on your mind. Let's keep the comments chill, so no hate or spoilers, as I'm not above removing those comments and the people who make them. That's all for now, folks, and I'll see you next time.